Watch out, Robin, he's out to cause trouble. Throwing you aside and he's off on the double. Watch out, Digger, he's out to cause trouble. <laughs> Knocking down the blocks and he's off on the double. Right on 
your tail. You're gonna end up in jail. Yes, you ended up in jail. Why don't you try and catch it? <laughs> nice try, Buster. But it's floating away. Aw, Buster looks sad. <laughs> oh, hey, little Robin. You might be able to catch the runaway red balloon. There we go. <laughs> Thanks, Robin. That's a nice-looking balloon, Buster. <laughs> oh, wow, there's another balloon. This one is green. <laughs> Quick, Robin, catch it. There we go. Now you have two balloons, Buster. Gosh, look at all those colorful balloons. You know what to do, Robin. <laughs> Buster! The balloons are lifting you off the ground. Robin has lost Buster. He's up there, Robin. Buster's flying. It's okay, Buster. Don't be scared. Look at the view from up here. <laughs> Terry can't work out where that horn is coming from. Look up there, Terry. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's Buster the Bus. <laughs> There's something you don't see every day. Oh, Buster, you're floating quite high now. Terry looks so small down there on the ground. I think Buster is starting to get scared. You don't want to end up in space, Buster. Robin, you've got to help. Great idea. If you pop the balloons, Buster will hopefully float down. Oh, no, Buster's falling really quickly. It's okay, Buster. You've nearly reached the ground. I think a few more balloons will do it, Robin. And touchdown. Buster is pleased to be back on the ground. I think we should leave the flying to Robin, Buster. Oh, where's Robin going? Ha, <laughs> huh, another balloon? I think Buster has had enough of balloons for one day. Bye, Buster. <laughs> Bye, Robin. Oh, hey, it's Buster the bus. I wonder what he's doing sitting on top of that snowy mountain. Whoa, Buster is speeding down the mountain. Look at him go. Be careful, Buster. The roads might be slippery. Hey, it's Suki, the train. She's puffing her way down the mountain. Now Suki and Buster are moving side by side. But I wonder who is going to get to the bottom of the mountain first. Buster and Suki are going to race to the bottom. Look at them go. Oh no, giant snowballs have rolled into the road. Look out, Buster. Buster's having to slow down. But Suki can keep going. Now Buster has caught up with Suki. It's neck and neck. What's this? Buster and Suki are taking different ways down the mountain. Suki goes over the bridge. Buster goes under it. Suki's going as fast as she can. Look, the tracks have changed. Suki is taking a shortcut to the finish line. She's speeding into the lead. Here comes Buster, but uh-oh, Suki is almost at the finish line. Buster will need to go super fast to catch her. Wait, I think Buster has an idea. Buster has made a snowboard out of that road sign. Nice job, Buster. Look how fast he can slide down the mountain. Buster's taken the lead. Hooray! Buster came first. Suki is right behind him. What fun that was. Buster and Suki had such a great time racing down the mountain. Hey, Buster. Itch. Oh, no. Buster looks really ill. <laughs> Hello, Scout. I think Scout wants to play. I don't think Buster is well enough to play today. Buster is feeling really ill. Quick, Scout. Go and get some help. Oh, poor Buster. It'll be okay. We all get poorly now and then. Oh, look! Scout has brought Amber the ambulance to have a look at Buster. Great idea, Scout. Amber will know what to do to make Buster feel better. 
It looks like Amber the Ambulance is helping Buster back into his garage. Let's see if she can find what's wrong with Buster. Firstly, let's check Buster's tires. Oh, look, this one has lost all of its air. It needs pumping up. There we go. That's better. Buster looks better already. Oh, but you're still a bit under the weather. Ah, yes. Let's check Buster's temperature with a thermometer. It doesn't look good, Buster. It's time for Amber to check Buster's engine. Oh, no! Buster's leaking oil! No wonder he's not feeling well. Amber will fix this with her spanner. It's okay, Buster. It'll be done soon. Just a few more turns. There we go. Great job, Amber! Buster looks like he's back to his normal self again. I think you're well enough to go out and play, Buster. Oh, he seems very pleased. That's the Buster we know and love. It's time for Amber to head off. Bye, Amber. Thank you for looking after Buster. Off Scout and Buster go to play. Bye. It's Buster the Bus. He looks very happy, doesn't he? But, oh no. It started to rain. And there's some scary thunder and lightning. Uh-oh. It's a thunderstorm. Whoa, look out for Scout, Buster. Oh, dear. Buster is so scared of the thunderstorm, he has left Scout behind in the rain. And now her wheel is stuck in the puddle. The lightning is everywhere now. Phew! Buster's safe and sound in the garage. But what about Scout? <gasps> Look, he has seen Scout. She really is stuck in that puddle. Will Buster be brave enough to go and help her? Scout's really struggling. Poor Buster. He is so scared of the thunder and lightning, isn't he? You can do it, Buster. Wow, the lightning is so bright and scary. Yay! Go, Buster! He looks very determined to help Scout now. A quick push should do the trick. Yay! Scout's free! Look how happy she is. Well done, Buster. Ooh, the thunder is still very loud, though. Oh, but look! Buster has overcome his fear. Buster and Scout are happily heading back to the garage to get in from the rain. Ooh, ha -ha, that thunder just made both of them jump! Bye, Buster! <laughs> Bye, Scout! Wakey, wakey, Buster! It's a brand new day! Wait a minute! There's no color! That's strange! Even Robin doesn't have any color! Look, Robin! Buster made you colorful again! Well done, Buster! <laughs> oh no, that baby duckling looks sad. She's lost her color. Maybe Buster can help. Great job! The color is back again. Oh, look how happy the duckling is now. Oh, look. Terry's farm has lost its color, too. Can Buster help? He sure can. You've got the magic touch, Buster. Oh, no. Not Scout, too. Go on, Buster. Help her be colorful again. There you go, Scout. Back to normal. Look. Buster can change the color of things, too. Now the ball is green. And now the ball is purple. Buster knows how to color things in. Wow! Buster made Scout rainbow colored. Now he's rainbow colored, too. It's Buster the Rainbow Bus. It's Terry again. Now it's Rainbow Terry. 
And look at all the fields. And the barn. Rainbow colors everywhere. Amazing. Buster even turned the clouds different colors. There's just one thing missing. A rainbow, of course. The rainbow bus is driving off over the rainbow. Bye-bye. Oh, Buster, it was only a dream. And it's raining outside. Oh, I'm sorry, Buster. <laughs> Wait. Maybe you're magic after all, Buster. You made the sun come out. Oh, Buster. It looks like you're all covered in mud. You had a lot of fun splashing through those muddy puddles. <laughs> it looks like Buster might need a wash. I'm not sure if he thinks so. Here comes the city bus. Oh dear, he doesn't look very impressed at how dirty Buster is. It looks like Buster has finally realized just how messy he looks. That's right, Buster. You're covered in mud. Is that a sign for a car wash? <laughs> Great idea, Buster. Off he goes to the car wash to clean himself up. Oh, poor Buster. He's too scared to go inside. It does look very scary, doesn't it? Go on, Buster. You can do it. You need to get clean. You're so dirty. He's going for it. Buster is being very brave indeed. One, two, three. Oh, no. You were so close, Buster. Oh, he sounds very impatient. Buster, take a deep breath. You can do it. Huh? But the sounds are so scary. Go on, Buster. You can do it. You're almost there. Ready, set, go! <laughs> You're doing it, Buster! It tickles. That's not so bad, is it? And out he comes! There! That wasn't so bad, was it, Buster? All sparkly and clean. Looking good. Wow, well done, Buster. Nice and clean. That car wash wasn't so scary after all. Buster and Daddy Bus are having a day out at the park. Uh-oh. Careful, Daddy. They're going to play some soccer together. It's time for kickoff. Buster passes the ball and... Uh-oh. Looks like Daddy hasn't quite got the hang of this. But Buster shows him how it's done. Time for a penalty shootout. Buster shoots and he scores. Oh, no. Daddy Bus, are you all right? Phew, he's okay. Now it's Buster's turn to be in goal. Daddy looks determined. Whoops, the ball's gone flying up in the air. Oh, look, it's Ash and Mommy Fire Truck. Buster is inviting them to join the game. Great idea, Buster. It's buses versus fire trucks. Let's go! Buster takes the ball. Ash dives in front. Mommy shoots for goal and she misses. Oops. I think Buster has another idea. I wonder what it is. Ash and Buster are teaming up. It's now kids versus parents. Who's going to win? Ash starts. Daddy takes the ball, but Ash tackles him. He passes to Buster. And Buster scores! Go, Buster! What great teamwork, everyone! They are both very tired as Daddy drives Buster home after a great day out. Oh, look! It's Mommy Bus! Buster waves goodbye to Daddy Bus. But wait! Buster is giving Daddy Bus the soccer ball! <laughs> he does need the practice! Buster, Scout, Bandit, and Ash are having a race! Buster and Bandit are neck and neck. But Scout's dashed into the lead. Whoosh! Scout won! Nice work, Scout. She really is super speedy. What's that noise? Thunder? Oh no, it's a storm! They should take cover or they'll get all wet. 
Whoa, that was close. Ash nearly skidded into his friends on the wet grass. Wait a minute, that gives Buster an idea. Whoosh, <laughs> skidding through those muddy puddles is great fun. They could play a game, see who can skid the furthest. What a great idea. Bandit is going first. Swish. He skidded all the way over there. But Scout thinks she can do better. Vroom. Whoa. Scout went even further than Bandit. Now it's Ash's turn. He's so little, he's spinning round and round. He's all dizzy, but he's gone the furthest yet. Last up, it's Buster. Whoosh. Uh-oh, he's getting out of control. Whoa! Oops, Buster splashed Mommy with mud. Looks like it's time for all the little vehicles to get back home. They're back at Buster's house in no time. But wait, they can't go inside until they're all cleaned up. Mommy's going to use the hose to wash all the mud off. Splish splash. <laughs> and there, now all four of them are clean again. But even so, that skidding race was so much fun. It's time for Buster to go to school. He mustn't forget his packed lunch. They're Scout. They don't want to be late. But who's this? A little fire truck? Buster is waving hello. At school, the teacher has a surprise. This is Ash. He's the new kid in school. He's going to be joining their class. Ash is going to Buster because he waved hello. He's so excited to have made a new friend already. Now today, the children are going to learn about parking. The teacher is showing them how to do it properly. Now it's their turn to try. Scout's got it. And Buster. Oh. Ash is sticking really close to his new friend. He's following Buster wherever he goes. He doesn't understand Buster is trying to park. Oh dear, I think he's got on Buster's nerves a bit. Buster wanted some space, but Ash didn't understand. At break time, Buster and Scout are playing. Aw, poor Ash has no friends to play with. But Buster and Scout have an idea. Ash can play with them. They're friends now after all. Now they're all playing together. Whoa, good shot, Ash. It's so nice to make new friends. It's a brand new day, and it's time for Buster to head off to school. There's Diggly. They can go to school together. They're going to race to school. Whoosh! I wonder who will be fastest. Whoa! There's a little duckling in the road. He should be more careful. There's a mommy duck. She's trying to cross the road with her ducklings. But look out! Here comes Terry. Here comes the teacher, too. Oh, no! Phew! Thanks to Diggly and Buster, the duck family can cross the road safely. Aw, they're going to swim in that pond. Uh-oh, that duckling is walking back to the road. <laughs> Good job, Buster. Now the ducks are going back over the road. Buster and Diggly are helping them cross safely. <laughs> Mommy duck is crossing, too. Well done, everyone, for helping! But Terry and the teacher want to get moving or they'll be late. Wait a minute. 
I think Buster has an idea. Hmm, what are they doing with those paints? White lines? And some signs. It's a duck crossing. Now the duck family can cross the road safely whenever they like. There's the teacher again. He's telling them to hurry up. The kids had better get to school or they'll be late. Nice work, everyone. 